Hey, welcome to a short video today. I wanted to discuss a pretty cool object that I just picked up on a collection um, that I've been that's been consigned to me to sell. And I'm not saying it's the best, but it's definitely one of the coolest pieces of sewer tile I've ever come across. Um, sewer tile is fun, you know those guys uh, making the a lot of it in Ohio, I guess Western Pennsylvania making it end of the 1800s, early 1900s, even mid 1900s, some of it, but. Uh, you know, those guys were pretty talented, and I guess at the end of the day, oftentimes they would kind of make funky or weird things, and this thing is no exception. I think it's one of the coolest pieces ever. As you can see, here are some of the most recent live auctioneer results, and you can see some of the other more expensive things um, over the last 10 or 15 years, I guess, in auction. I've sorted by top price first, and these are all completed auctions, so these are sold listings. The forms get somewhat repetitive. A lot of animals, a lot of seated dogs. Uh, you see some cats too. Planners are a popular form as well. Chickens, like I said, a lot of animals. This bus coming up sold by Crocker Farms. I really like that. I think that's actually probably better than some of the stuff that sold for more money than it. Now you see a seat and a barrel. Um, a couple of these things, it's hard to tell from the photos, but are actually really big. So that helps account for the price. Neither of the pigs do much for me. There was another one that sold for a lot more money. I think relative to the cost that uh, World War I Aviator bust was a good deal. When you look at the prices that some of the other stuff brought. What about my piece? How does it compare? Where does this stack up? I don't know, but check it out. <laughs> That's right. It's a cannon. <laughs> so weird. Do you, need a, do you need a pottery sewer tile cannon? Probably not. Uh, do you want one? Probably, because it's cool. <laughs> Look at this. It's so funny and weird. It's uh, Maker's Initials, JG. Got this horse head for some reason. I don't know. A, uh, a lion sort of incised or stamped into it. Um, remarkably good condition. I think this is probably uh, right around the turn of the century. Or first quarter of the 21st century. I think what really sets it apart is the size. It just has a lot of presence. Here's a close-up of those... JG, the horse, and the lion that I was talking about has a lot of flair. I don't know. Is it the coolest coolest one ever? Uh, probably not. Is it one of the coolest? Probably so. <laughs> if, you've, uh, if you know of any other pretty cool examples that I haven't shown, uh, please let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you think of this. Um, would you want to own this? Let me know. And anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe. And I'll show you some of the fun, cool stuff that as I find it. Thanks.